Welcome back to our channel. Let's start with the news today. UK says Russian forces struggling. About 20,000 people have managed to escape the besieged port of Maripol in private car. The Ukrainian interior ministry said on Wednesday that hundreds of thousands remain trapped by Russian shelling, many without heating, power, and running uh, waters. Russian forces have fo focused on Maripol, constantly uh, bombarding it for the past two weeks. Addis is a key city on the Azov Sea coast, which they must gain control of the two coasts uh, for the west. Ukrainian officials estimate that more than 2,500 uh, residents had been killed in the fighting and at least uh, 200,000 are in the urge need of uh, evacuation. Moscow has not captured any of the Ukraine's 10 biggest cities following its invasion that began on February 24, the largest assault on a European state since 1945. Russian forces are struggling to overcome the challenges posed by Ukraine terrains, according to Britain's Ministry of Defense in an intelligence report on Wednesday. Russian troops have remained largely tied to Ukraine road network and have demonstrated a reluctance to conduct up road maneuvers. The destruction of bridges by Ukrainian forces has also played a key role in stalling Russian advance, he said. And Russian continued failure to gain control of the air has drastically limited its option. The tactics of the Ukrainian armed force have adeptly exploited a Russian lack of maneuvers, frustrating the Russian advance and uh, inflicting heavy losses of, on the invading forces, said the report. Russia called its uh, actions a special military operation to demilitarize and uh, denazify de Ukraine. Ukraine and Western allies call this a baseless pretext for a world that has raised fears of wider conflicts in Europe. This is the end of our news today. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching and see you next time.